I used to tune into WHBK. I remember my freshman year in high school, Wednesday nights, WHBK came on. And I would get tired like pretty much around 10, 15. So I would just put the, uh, the cassette in. I had the kind of cassette that after it recorded to the end, it would flip over automatically. So I could just put the tape in and just record uh, JP Chill. And you know, he ran a station like a jazz show, you know, where he would play all the hip hop joints and he may get in the middle of the show and says, oh, we got an educational coming up. So he played a break beat. If you can tell me who made this break beat, you can win tickets to come down here and check out such and such or whatever. So HBK was definitely like a major, major, major influence as far as just being hip to all the B, the B side records, you know, everything from, um, you know, the East Coast to the West Coast, ultra magnetic to too short and everything in between, you know, you got from HBK, you know what I mean? It was just like a, a serious blueprint at that time to kind of, you know, kind of, it, 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 it gave me the knowledge of it, you know what I mean, as far as the music was concerned. So.